So there is a little bit of a knot that I kind of expected that to happen. But you'll see how this wraps up. It should wrap up pretty good. Close this, put this off like that. And for the most part, chores are done. We just gotta wrap this up so that we can have this ready for the next time whoever is doing chores next, which will definitely be me, um, is ready to go. Let me get this freaking steel out of the way. Mr. Keenan wishes there was more time in a day and I try to maximize as much as I can so that I can be a dad, be a teacher, and be a farmer all at the same time. It definitely has a balance. Okay, so we're gonna wrap this up. Now that the, the pressure's off, we can, there's no more water in there. The rest of the water will probably drain out the hose like this. So I'll hook this up here like this. I'll do the first, I'll start looping it onto here. And once you do your first loop, just sneak this back behind this board like that. So it will, everything will stay. This way when you go to take it off and you flop it down like I did, it should end up doing that. Now if you go to start pulling it up and it's, if it's catching right there, what I, what I will do is I will grab that nest and grab the rest of the hose to wrap it up. We'll go like this and we'll sort of line it up with the door and it should come straight in. We'll pull it out that way towards the burn barrel and it should come straight in without any fuss. Just like that, even with the, the, the tail left over, that will fix itself as you pull it in and you'll be able to wrap it up. You don't have to have it, just get it so it, it's contained in this area. It doesn't have to be wrapped a perfect, a perfect loop. You're just doing this so you can get it contained in here. It doesn't have to be a perfect wrap, but this is how I'm, I'm doing it. And right now, as we're pulling this in, because of the slope of the height of me and gravity and physics, the water will be drained by the time we pull this in. So I'll come up here, come a little bit closer, just like that. This is gonna be a nice, a nice wrap for you. So it'd be really easy for you to pull this out. And now notice we have the big knot right there. Might have to go untangle it a little bit. With you, I don't know if it's gonna, it'll knot up the way that this is knotting up. But like I said, if you don't do it exactly like me, that's okay. You do it the way you need to. I will untangle this so that It'll be good to go. Perfect. Can't wait to be done with this video so I can finish up some other things. I'm probably not gonna go to sleep because um, I'm definitely feeling plenty of energy. I, had a, I was in a very deep sleep when I fell asleep with Charlie. Those daughters in my crib tonight in that when I go to lay them to bed and I snuggle with them, being a dad, I'm sure your dad probably was the same way. If he snuggled with you guys, he'd fall right asleep just like me. So it's probably the one time you're most relaxed is when you know your babies are sleeping when they're at the age of mine. Look at that, a nice wrap ready to go for Jaren Popovich. And so what I do with the extra, what I do with the extra is I'll do one last little loop and put this through here. I literally just invented that today, but that looks, looks perfect. So when you guys, when you guys go come to do water today, put it in here like this, lift it up and do that. If you don't want to mess with this, take the, take the feed pails. If I find the extra one or just take one of the feed pails once you've fed everybody and just carry, kill, carry water with the pails. But this works very convenient. I'm going to leave these gloves. Um, probably on top of this. And obviously a skid loader is not a proper place to store a window air conditioner when you're not doing it, but right now that works just fine. Um, but I'll put these here so that, that way they'll be able to dry and you'll be able to use them if you want to. Um, I got a second pair of gloves over there, but chores are done. That's how it works. If you have any questions, you got my number, call me. What the heck was that? I did have a light, look at that. I did have my headlamp out there. I could have used that when I was out there, but we're in good shape. You're a good man, Jer Jaren Popovich, and Jaden, if you watch this too, and any other Popoviches, your parents do a good job raising you. Have a good day.